Hi folks, welcome to another edition of Big on Wine. Here I am out in my garden and have I got a wine for you that's just in keeping with the spirit of summer. It's a ravishing rosé from Austria's Niederösterreich coming right up. Hi folks, yes indeed, this is Tony Melville with another edition of Big on Wine, the show that brings you news, clues and reviews about, yes, everything in the world of wine. And hey, if you're new here, why not consider subscribing? OK, my wine of the week for this week is this one here. It's a rosé wine from Niederösterreich, in fact, from the small market town of... Uh, Grafen Eck, it's a small market town of about 3,000 people, and it's just to the east of Krems an der Donau. Now, we've been through Krems an der Donau before, it's uh, just to the west of Vienna. Now, I don't do rose wine very often, so when I do, it really has to be a good one. And this one here really fills the bill. This is Josef and Philipp. Brundelmeier's Zweigelt Rosé 2016. So the new vintage rosé, 12% alcohol and coming in for a price of just under 14 euro a bottle. So we're talking a quality rosé here. Comes from Grafenek um, to the east of Krems in Niederösterreich and of course that's a small market town bordered on the west and south side by the River Kamp. Now the Zweigelt grape may be unfamiliar to many of you. Now it's basically a red grape. It's a grape that's found predominantly in Austria, uh, but also to some extent in Hungary and Slovakia and Canada as well. It's a cross, an Austrian variety, a cross between St. Laurent and Blau Frankish. And about 50% of Austrian red wine is in fact made nowadays from the Zweigelt grape. Now it's a dry wine, um, obviously a red grape, gently pressed with very little contact with the skins. Now in the glass it's a wonderful kind of um, warm pinkish red, it's a wonderfully attractive colour. Um, crystal clear, looks absolutely gorgeous in the glass, especially drunk outdoors on a sunny day. So let's have a little sniff. And in the nose, yeah, now that is very, 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 very giving. Um, immediately I'm getting some raspberry, raspberry notes there. Um, also, maybe a little bit of minerality as well. Very, very attractive in the nose. Now in the mouth, boy oh boy, this is packed with flavour. Um, there's raspberry in there, um, but there's also plenty of other fruit. Um, what am I getting? I'm getting some red currant. Red currant, yep. What have we got so far? Raspberry, red currant, maybe even a touch of lingonberry produces a wonderful tickle on the tongue. This is just, um, you know, wonderful for the outdoor life. Um, let's have another swig, it's so good. And in the finish, I would say the long finish, there is also just a touch of strawberry. So a very, very nice, fruity, crisp wine particularly for the outdoor life here. Now, what kind of food is this going to be good with? Well, I think you could drink as much of this as you like, just as an aperitif. But if you're going to be looking for some dishes to have with this, I would say some flavorful, flavorful dishes. This is pretty, pretty big on flavor itself. Um, salads, uh, grilled chicken. How about deep fried white bait or even vendes? Uh, smoked fish. The outdoor life on a hot summer's day. That's what this wine is all about. Okay, so let's bring you the heads up on this excellent wine. We're talking Brindelmeier Zweigelt Rosé, vintage 2016, coming in for under 14 euro a bottle. 
This is one you really do have to get the uh, temperature right on, so that serving temperature has got to be cold, around the 6 to 7 degree mark. I'm going to give this rosé three stars plus out of five. Okay guys, if you enjoyed what you've uh, seen and heard on the show today, on this little introduction to the Brindlemeyer Rosé, then please do give us a big thumbs up. Feel free to comment and share. And of course, you can always subscribe by hitting that big button up there in the top left hand corner of your screen. I'll be back again next week with another great wine of the week for your pleasure and enjoyment. Until then, take care, enjoy your wine, enjoy the summer. Bye for now. <laughs>